Welcome to Streaming the Legs. My name is Mr. Orange and today we're going to talk about Helix Vision, which is a 3D gaming theater application developed by Bob Johnson and Markus Kundert and is in the best sense uh, yeah, called like uh, putting 3D vision and video 3D vision gaming stereoscopic gaming into the VR world. But my friends, before we jump into this video, I would say we go to our yeah, our daily giveaway, so you can win, you can win a Nagoni key, a Metal Gear Solid Ground Zeroes key, a Valhalla Hill key or a Doom 3 key. So the winner can choose between those keys. So we already have our last video here uh, in comment picker. So I have 18, 18 unique uh, commenters and someone of those 18 unique commenters can win this, can win one of those keys. And yeah, comment and please this video, like it and sub to my channel, then you can participate in one of the next giveaway videos. Let's go! And the winner is Yiri Ro. I'm here to like the video. Thank you very much, dude. Thank you very much. So you, you, you made it correctly. You liked the video, you commented and therefore you get one of those keys so write me an email which one you choose let's continue all right guys so today i talk about helix vision helix vision is uh, in the steam store page it's written it's an epic stereoscopic gaming helix mod is in virtual 3d tv brings your full length 2d games into third dimension try our free slideshow demo in vr so that's that's the most important part now before you ask yourself what is this yes you you have to let's say two different hardware uh, conditions uh, you should uh, fulfill either you have a VR headset so they are not so expensive anymore or you have a NVIDIA 3D Vision uh, screen a compatible screen and you have a graphics card etc uh, from NVIDIA so either either head mounted display for VR or or you have a 3D Vision uh, screen so but then then you can use it and for this reason download the helix vision demo download the demo it's for free and uh, i mean buy it for 399 i think dollar would would be also the same 399 dollars so very very cheap nothing special with this and uh well what's going on what's going on so you can uh, we, we will open it directly for you so i go now here this is the stop page so you see some information here from from early access so read through this and you you understand better what's going on and also here you can read a little bit more what this is about so maybe i want to give you a very quick uh, a little bit background yiri ro here you are man <laughs> so this is the helix mod page that's very important so here it, where it's all started uh helix mods uh in order to play NVIDIA 3D Vision games back in the days uh, uh, in 3D, you needed to have a special driver from NVIDIA and uh, and then you could play the games in 3D, but very often uh, the games were not really looking good in 3D. So therefore Helix Mod was uh, created by, a, by a, a coder called Helix and uh it's nowadays it's a it's a yeah it's a still a lively community i would i would say and uh and then the community started to 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 to, to kind of mod the games uh mod mod the shaders of the games that then the build the the, the image would be in, in, in a better stereoscopic way so otherwise you would have different shaders that that are off uh, different shaders that are overlapping and you don't really get the stereoscopic 3d effect uh, is it like a stereoscopic uh, a stereoscopic 3d tv no at all it's very it has a very high level of depth and uh, it has a has a 3d effect that's really mind-blowing so it's it's much more let's say it's much more like 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 the v like vr 3d nowadays so everyone uh, i guess uh, watch my watches my channel has tried out uh, vr nowadays so it's it's more in this sense so, so it's all started here and uh, if you if you download the helix vision you're going to have the 3d fix manager so i can put you also link uh, down below 
um, in, in the description of the video and the helix uh, fix manager is very important because it it helps you to get uh, get a functioning functioning driver so you can get one of the last drivers uh, that was by nvidia for 3 d vision uh, and still use your new driver so it's uh, it's just it just helps you to play on a new machine with new drivers uh, 3d again so this is very very important my friends all right so yeah i can also hear the wikipedia article i mean you get a little bit about uh, history discontinuation april 11th uh, nvidia announced that they would not uh, support uh, 3d anymore which is actually really sad so the last driver is the 425.31 driver and uh, i see also something written about uh, the helix mod block hmm, i don't see it here so, but all of this is not so important because if you go here now and you you get Helix Vision, you get the you're going to get the um, 3D Fix Manager, and you're going to have the possibility, my friends, you're going to have the possibility, my friends, to play it. Here we are. So the resolution of the VR headset is uh, is not so good, so therefore it might be a little bit pixelated, and you need definitely also a machine which is very very strong, but because imagine you're going to play uh, a Plague Tale Innocence or you're going to play uh, Devil May Cry 5 uh, if Helix Vision, so in your VR headset together with the stereoscopic uh, driver so you definitely need a, a strong strong machine so I have for example now th those are all my installed games here on the left side you see all my installed games that support that are supporting uh, VR and where where a fix a 3d fix exists for example we can go now click uh, bayonetta then uh, if you now say ah i want to play bayonetta with my vr headset in 3d then i recommend you to install the fix here it goes very fast downloading extracting and it's installed and then you can choose here to play it in 2d it's just normal you just normal play it on your 2d flat screen or you play it even you or you play it in uh, 3D, for example, then you need to have a 3D screen or you play it in VR, which is then also possible. So I, uh, it's not possible now for me to actually start it uh, like this because then I have to, uh, then I have to, 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 to put now my VR headset on. But uh, I, for example, I use at the moment the 3D Fix Manager to, uh, together with Felix Vision to play those games again uh, in 3D with the new driver. So for me, that's the best way. Uh, at the moment how I go back to uh, 3D vision gaming but for you guys it's it's this year is this play in VR because I guess most people now watching might have a, might have a VR headset but do not really own a 3D vision no 3D vision screen or a 3D vision compatible uh, projector so then uh, for you that's maybe the way to go with the uh, with VR so pretty pretty cool pretty cool so uh, which is maybe important so yeah so I can explain you a little bit so you have all games installed games all fixed types so there are different fixed types you have 3d Migoto direct x11 you have the helix mod was uh, back in the times in direct x9 you have an open gl wrapper uh, and then you have uh, we are compatible unverified verified 3d fixes without fixes so those are now not interesting for us if we use a 3d fix manager then here you can click for example on the 3d fix itself you see here bayonetta platinum engine helix mod direct x9 you have a different wrapper version so here for example that's my path so yeah, d steam d steam apps common bayonetta nothing special and then you can even manage the different hotkeys only for the application that's really cool then uh, we have here the overall 3d sessions we have application settings and video 3d settings and we have a display profile so a lot is going on here so here you can choose all your different all your different uh, path where i can find those games so it's not only steam games he's finding he's also finding origin or epic games which is pretty amazing i really like this so it's actually for me the best uh, overall launcher uh, best, la best better launcher than for example the GOG Galaxy 2.0 in this respect my friend. 
So a lot of interesting settings. Don't change too much here. Maybe this might be the the only recommendation I can uh, give you. But uh, what you might use is are the advanced hard case because you want to decrease and increase uh, convergence with Control F5, Control F6. That's important. You can enable the laser sight. Uh, in the game, uh, then you can, can change uh, this, the, 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 the laser sight uh, uh, tool that you want to use. So install recommend GeForce driver. You see we have the old 425 uh, GeForce driver installed and then you have display profiles. And here we have a little bit about. So that's uh, that's a 3D fix manager made by Markus Gundert, Paul Duslo. 3D fixes developed by shader hackers. That's very important. So we have also here different links to different forums and uh, The shader hackers here. Yeah, they're called shader hackers the guys who who make the guys who make those those uh, Those fixes for example if you click now here on the waylanders you can see wow, that's actually a lot of us going on It's actually not so easy to understand this but then you just click here on uh, Waylander 3D version ready fix version 1.0 and then you just put it uh, in the uh, in the folder where the, exe the, the executive uh, file of Waylanders is located and then sometimes you have to change uh, different different uh, uh, different settings in the in the graphic cards or in the uh, graphic options menu, but uh, it's much easier to be honest, guys. It's much easier to just use the 3D Fix Manager. So this is what I do at the moment. It's amazing. I how I'm just like Life is Strange too. I just bought it now, so that's an amazing game. So I want to play this definitely with 3D with 3D Vision, but I can also play it now in VR. So I fortunately don't have my VR headset installed right now, but you can also play it in VR. So on a big big screen. So I'm looking forward to my new index that I'm going to get soon, and then this will look amazing with a better resolution. So for now, I like to play it uh, with my. 3D vision screen, so the resolution is then the highest that I can use on my machine. So you you can see you can play games like Prey, you can play play games like Shadow of the Tomb Raider with Dart X 11, 12. You can play Terminator Resistance, this War of Mine. Oh my God, Zombie Army Trilogy. So there's so many games. So there are now only those games that I have installed, but there are so many other games that you can play with 3D Vision and so with the new Helix Vision uh, and 3D Fix Manager uh, solution. Dark Souls 1, 2, Crash Bandicoot, Borderland 3. So this is, it's, it's modding. So but this is maybe important to say. It's 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 modding. It's it's not something uh, officially created by by the uh, by Nvidia or by by other companies. So only the driver is officially by Nvidia, but everything around is uh, created by a great community. And uh, not always it works perfect. It does not always work perfect. So therefore, uh, if you if you go here on the stop page, you're going to see yeah mostly positive came out on 2nd of September so we're also going to find some negative reviews some people are putting a thumbs down so yeah it's not always working perfect so but you if you keep this in mind you're going to have a lot of fun with this with this little application so I love it already a lot so I'm using it at the moment to play my three division games but uh, yeah, I'm also going to use it uh, with a new VR headset when I'm going to have a better resolution. So I definitely recommend to you download the Helix Vision demo if, you, if you're unsure if you want to play it uh, or if you want to purchase it, sorry. And uh, my God, four euros, four dollars, it's like nothing. And guys, you're going to love it. Believe me, it's a, it's a great tool. All right, thank you very much for watching and uh, uh, kudos to the 3 vision uh, community out there and for all my new viewers so check out this you're going to see uh, there's a little bit more behind uh, normal flat screen uh, 2d gaming even if it's called 3d gaming uh, it's not actually uh, when it's <laughs> when it's not stereoscopic all right thank you very much for watching see you next time bye bye